Why should it be? No, well, I've heard well, when, you, you heard when you're that? real, I mean, when you're farther along, mm -hmm. I guess, because it gives you the digestion but for no other reason. Oh, but it doesn't make it up, right? the, the, the nourishment that you, everything you eat goes into the nourishment of the baby. Well, of course, That's but it's, true. but it's, so uh, it's going to be bad for the baby. Now, is it going to be kidding? It's bad for the baby. The immune system, system will get it out of there. I'll do it without music and then I'll do it with No, music. don't do anything until yes. I come back. Yes, she's going to do it without music. What are we getting back? Say that again. Jackie. 
got a good picture of your behind. Hey, where'd y'all go? Boom. Remember that special like, things that you were gonna start? You wanted to learn about doing the like the cupid thing and all that. Did you get information on that or? No more. They're gonna read your lips. Hey, what's your name? Tell them what your name is and how old you are. No, to tell them a story. Say, right, come on. You stupid man. If yeah. Dad sees it, he'll get mad. They both look towards her eyes are wide on me. Tell Daddy about your birthday party at McDonald's. Yay!
of, of the rock rock era in the 1980s. And we've got here with us, we've got Irma Boom Boom from the <laughs> from the group of the Croquettes. They're a nationally famous rock group and they specialize in heavy metal rock. And here's Irma and she is the lead singer of, like I said, the Croquettes. And we'd like to ask you a couple of questions today. Boom Boom. What is the general age of your audience? Have you? Well, in our general audience, we've got the majority is teenagers, and I'm very famous in the band. I mean, everybody likes me, you know. I can't help it if I'm such a good singer. I've got plenty. I've got every time I, I go out and play somewhere, I've got a big audience. It's really great, you know. I advise some of you girls out there, you know, if you want to get in the music business, you know, hey. Give it a try. <laughs> okay, I'm sure a lot of your audience would like to know, who do you feel had the greatest contribution to your starting in your career? Well, what's your name? <laughs> <laughs> well, my, my father was, was, he used to be a piano, uh, piano player, and my mom used to play, uh, my mother used to play piano. Uh, was an opera singer, and my, my father used to play backups with the piano. And I just came musically inclined to this since birth. You know, I was born with it. And I also had an older brother, you know, he was in a heavy metal band. He, he was a drummer, and the group was called Born Rat. And uh, I just came music. <laughs> How much, Irma, do you think you've gained in your career since you've started back in the early 80s? How much money can you, can you give us a general figure of how much you are worth today? <laughs> well, I don't. Well my, well, my last album, which was entitled Be My Baby, <laughs> it sold 50 million copies. And I'm, I'm really proud of that. I'm really happy that, and ten dollars that I succeeded. $10 an album. Uh -huh. $10 an album. No, John, that's it. I don't know what to say. This concludes our interview with Corpus Tonight, Irma with the Croquettes. We'd like to ask you to join us next week. Same hour, same channel. Same time. One last question, Irma. Barbara. No, I'm Barbara. Oh. Do you have any steady love?